Hey guys, Paul here, and I'm excited that it's Veterans Day. So first, a huge shout out to all the veterans out there. Thank you for your service and for everything that you've done for us. Uh, Vets Turn is really about putting that gratitude into action. And so I'm really excited to share with you some updates and welcome eight new members into the Vets Turn community. So. First, for those of you who are not familiar with Vets Turn, uh, Vets Turn is a woodworking, wood turning club for U.S. combat veterans dealing with PTSD. To welcome new members on board, we provide them with a full wood turning setup, and I'll talk about the details of that in just a little bit. Uh, and then we provide them with classes and support ongoing uh, to, to help them be successful in, in wood turning. Uh, the second observation I'd share about Vets Turn is that really what we've seen is that this is working. It's working for the members. There's bonds being formed. There's healing that is happening uh, as a result of making beautiful objects, sharing that with the community and so forth. So I've been thrilled with the results that I've seen and I think others around the program would, would tell you the same. A uh, third thing that I'd just mention is that you know, I get questions about, you know, okay, there's sponsors, but really, where does all this come from? There is no big pot of money funding this. Uh, there's no grant, nothing. This is just like-minded people pooling resources, coming together to provide what we can and welcome in as many new members into the program as possible each year. So that's kind of how it works. So. So speaking of supporters, here's a, a, a view of who's involved in 2022. Uh, I, I've gone through this and, and all of these, uh, most of these have been with us since day one. We were welcoming a couple new uh, folks this year. Turner's Warehouse is getting involved this year. Uh, Niles joined us kind of mid-year last mid -year last year and they're continuing on this year as well. So huge gratitude to all of these supporters uh, that make this program possible. Extra Extra shout out, I just feel compelled to acknowledge the amazing work that uh, Easywood Tools has done this year in bringing um, more resources to bear. They've provided a tool set for every member since day one. This year they went above and beyond that and, and they've provided uh, uh, they, they generated a fundraiser, designed a t-shirt, sold the t-shirt on their website and at events and they generated a lot of money. I would say if it wasn't for their efforts, we would probably be here talking about welcoming four, maybe five new members, and because of what they've done, we can take that up to eight new members into the program. So very thank you, very grateful to Chris and Christy and the full team over at Easywood Tools. Okay, so just to kind of recap the tool set and supplies that each new member will receive. It's a Laguna 1216 lathe, a full set of tools from Easywood Tools, a Nova Chuck with some special pen turning jaws, a set of uh, videos from George Von Driska, a safety mask uh, that I'll provide for each member, uh, the uh, wood blanks uh, that were hand cut by um, uh, the Wood from the Hood gang. Uh, and Rick has been doing that every year since day one. Uh, and then a, a set of uh, pen turning supplies and gear from uh, Turner's Warehouse. That, that's, that has been a, a, a request from people in the program since very early on. So I'm just so excited that they've joined us this year in providing a, a very nice setup of pen turning supplies. Uh, and then also from Niles, the, uh, the setup of, of uh, bottle stopper gear. And then from Rockler, I'll be going out shopping uh, using a gift card that Rockler provided and I'll add some additional uh, goodies to the setup as well. So thanks to Rockler who's supported this since day one as well. Okay, so now let's introduce the eight new members um, that'll be joining us this year. So in no particular order, first, Jeremy from Oklahoma, Army veteran who spent some time in Iraq. Douglas from Texas, also an Army veteran, also some time in Iraq, as well as Af Afghanistan and Saudi Arabia. Travis comes to us from Michigan, uh, is a Marine, also Iraq, uh, also Afghanistan. James joins us from Kansas. James is a veteran of both the Army and the Navy and uh, is a Vietnam veteran, our first Vietnam veteran in the program. So welcome, James. 
And then uh, next up, BJ from Arkansas, uh, Army veteran, uh, spent time in Iraq. Joshua from South Dakota, Army National Guard veteran, uh, also Iraq. Sarah from Texas, uh, Navy veteran, spent time in Iraq and Afghanistan. And then finally, uh, Brian uh, from Minnesota. Brian is a Navy veteran, uh, spent some time in the Persian Gulf as well as Somalia. And Brian is our first Minnesota member, which is uh, great to see. I'm, all, I'm a Minnesotan and uh, it would be good to have a fellow Minnesotan here. So welcome to the new eight new members. That brings us to 22 members strong. So I'm really excited to see how crowded this slide is getting. I look forward to the day when I need to have a couple slides to show the full crew or shrink the pictures down so small. But I want you to be able to see the new, I want you to, be able to see all the members. Okay, so what happens next? So tools are ordered. They will be arriving very soon. Uh, when everyone has their equipment, I'm going to schedule a session and do kind of an orientation. Go over the equipment, answer questions. I'll do a couple turning demos. Uh, some, a spindle, uh, probably a snowman, uh, and a, a small bowl. Just to kind of get um, things off to a start and give people what they need to get started turning safely. After that, we'll get into the uh, the, the deeper uh, training, we'll do these on a sort of a monthly cadence, uh, whatever works for people. Carl will start doing a pen, or excuse me, doing a, uh, a bottle stopper demo, which got me very excited last year, and I turned then a bunch of bottle stoppers, which was a lot of fun. Mark Branch, who is a returning Vets Turn member, uh, he was a part of the 20, I believe 2020 cohort, uh, and got so good at pen turning that uh, we asked him if he'd come and, uh, and teach the rest of us how to do that. So he did that last year, it was a huge hit, and he's back to do it again this year. Uh, and then George Von Driska, I'm sure you all know George, Woodworkers Guild, Guild of America, and if you read woodworking magazines, he's been in all of them, he's written in all of them, so George will be doing a session with us. And then Michael Early, if you don't follow him on social media currently, I would strongly encourage you to do so. He does things with turning that I don't, still really don't understand. So it's just so cool uh, and amazing what he does. So uh, Michael will be uh, uh, presenting to us as well. And then from there, who knows? We'll see what people want to see and uh, you never know what might happen next. So I'm so excited about that lineup. Uh, this makes Vets Turn uh, just that much more exciting for all of the members to have this kind of lineup of pros uh, teaching uh, us uh, about various aspects of wood turning. So with that, let me know if you have any questions down below. Contact me directly if Vets Turn is something that you want to get involved with or if you have someone that you believe would be a good uh, participant in the program. Please reach out to me. Let's have that conversation. I'll answer any questions I can below. Hope you subscribe to the Toolmetrics channel. Follow along with uh, Vets Turn and other shenanigans that I do here on the, on the channel. So thanks for watching and uh, let's be in touch.